Tonight, chaos in the streets of France for the third night in a row, with police making dozens of arrests. Earlier in the day, activists posting videos of protesters storming through a major shopping center. And throughout France, clashes with police. Last night in Lyon, protesters ransacked the town hall, smashing storefront windows. Police are trying to block off streets to try and corral the crowd, but you can already see dumpster fires already happening, debris all in the grass here, and you can still smell that there's tear gas in the air. French people angry after President Emmanuel Macron forced through a pension reform bill without a vote, increasing the retirement age from 62 to 64. Frustration fueling strikes, airlines to railway service disrupted, garbage piling up. Why is 62 to 64 a big deal? To be able to work and as well to have our proper life and good health. She's talking about a quintessential French value of work-life balance. And French citizens say they pay more in taxes than most. So the return, an early retirement. But Macron and his supporters say with a lower birth rate and people living longer, the pension program is in jeopardy of running a deficit. Now this hallmark of French life hangs with the opposition, who will hold a vote of no confidence in the coming days that could collapse Macron's government and overturn the bill. A vote from lawmakers could come as soon as tomorrow or Monday, but these protesters say they're not letting up. In fact, a national strike is scheduled for Thursday. Jose? Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.